Hi, this is Melody Payne at MelodyPayne.com. This deck of boom cards reviews minor chords and their inversions, root position, first inversion, and second inversion. Students identify the chord that's presented and then choose the inversion of that chord, pressing the submit button afterwards to check their answers. This particular chord, B flat minor, first inversion, G minor, root position. Let's get this one wrong so I can show you what happens here. As you can see, all the multiple choice answers correspond with different notes within the chord, plus a different answer here and there. So students who are working through this deck really need to understand how the chords and inversions are put together. In the case of this chord, we know that it's a C sharp minor second inversion, but I'm going to do G sharp minor second inversion and show you what happens. The second inversion answer was correct. The G sharp minor answer was incorrect. So there's another opportunity to choose from the remaining answers that we can see here. You can choose again and again until all the answers have been chosen, leaving only the correct answer. But hopefully that won't be the case for your students. We're going to say this one, D flat minor, root position. You can see that some of the chords are on the bass staff, some are on the treble staff. Every chord in this deck comes in both treble and bass staff options. There are 90 total cards in this deck, 45 treble cards and 45 bass cards. The cards are randomized so that each time a student plays the deck, the cards will be presented in a different order. Cards are limited to 25 cards per play. And that's a quick introduction to this set of minor chords and inversions boom cards. This is Melody Payne. Thanks so much for watching.